welcome back friends now it's time to test the bootstrap and jquery so come to the main.js page and type document document dot ready now document is ready we call a function that function is called anonymous function now this time to this time is for test alert and type hello save it this file is already included main.js so no need to and for this this is our local host project one index.php just run this oh it says hello it's working now this time to test bootstrap come to the page index.php and come to the body part and add a bootstrap predefined class which is nothing but jumbotron jumbotron just add this class and test this and run hello whoa it's not working the problem is where is problem Oh my god, this is link and this should be here. Cut paste it here because it is an a style sheet. Remove this save and let's run this. Oh it's fine, it's working. We have a jumbotron. This is the big header. So uh, we can modify this jumbotron with colors and anything with the chain. Uh, you can write uh, additional style sheet for this jumbotron and you can change the background color and anything else. So first of all remove this jumbotron. Uh, now for the shopping cart template just give a container, not container, nav bar. navbar inverse navbar fixed top let's run this oh we have a navbar with inverse property of bootstrap come to this page and remove this header because it disturbs now go within this and play class add a container container hyphen include then container fluid we have class nav bar header nav bar nav bar header nav bar nav bar header within nav bar header we have a link a href equals to hash nothing add a class a and add a class nav bar hyphen brand on store save it and this kind of store it is a little bit big why i don't know just remove this class nav bar and save it and let's run this okay it's fine let's close now we need to add uh, some list your tag in this your tag uh, we have a class nav nav bar nav this, these are all the predefined classes of bootstrap main.css 
nav nav the nav in this we have list in list we have a link hash close this link tag and type So give it a name. Home. Oh. What happened? Just save this and run in the browser. Yeah, we have home. Copy this three times. Change it to product. and remove this link remove this link give input text class equals to form hyphen control and id equals to search Do the style. Style with 300 pixel and copy this input and paste it here uh, with the type. Submit form control ID search underscore button and give style. First, let's check this. Uh, change this class BTN BTN icon primary. Okay, we have home product search box and submit button. Now give style 300 pixel. Uh, left margin from left 10 pixel. Margin from top 10 pixel. Here uh, top 10 pixel left 20 pixel save this and see what happened ok it's look fine copy this ul tag and paste it here remove this style id search and uh, give it a name let's save this and run this we have home product we have cart and then Just copy this log in. Uh, it will be sign up. So test this home product. I haven't saved. Oh yeah, save this and add a class nav bar uh, right okay we have 
cart sign in sign up uh, in my in my this tutorial there is a icon cart and uh, another icon notification for notification this is a user icon and this is a home icon model icon in the bootstrap uh, website there is uh, so many types of icons given uh, get bootstrap.com so uh, click on components Here is glyph icons. Here is uh, glyph icon. There are so many glyph icons. Uh, you need to add these types of glyph icons in your uh, in input uh, and whatever you have. You can add these glyph icons anywhere. Glyph icon, glyph icon, align, center. So come to the page index.php and I'm going to add a uh, glyph icon uh, shopping cart. So just type uh, span and closing tag of span within span give it class glyph icon glyph icon hyphen shopping hyphen cart so test this no if I can shopping cart spelling mistake so we have a shopping cart icon like this I'm going to add so I added uh, glyph icons uh, this is a list uh, home I have a I add a glyph icon home glyph icon glyph icon hyphen home similarly for product I added a glyph icon model hyphen window and similarly for shopping cart and for use sign in and sign up for user if i can happen user let's save this and come to the page let's refresh so we have icon sign in sign up model window and home so everything is ready meet you in the next tutorial and so i hope you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe